So I get this uh, computer here um, and she complains that it gets this blue screen and as I'm starting this video obviously it went to the blue screen so let's check it out. So I ran the uh, system uh, test um, from the uh, BIOS itself and uh, we have a problem with the um, hard drive. The short DST check failed um, which is the um, drive self test. So let's pull out this uh, drive and see what's up with it. Hopefully we can get um, her data out. So I removed all of the uh, hidden screws over here. This was very annoying. There's hidden screws underneath that thing. And we're down to the hard drive. Let's do that. Let's take it out. All right, so we have the hard drive here connected to my handy dandy SATA connector. And um, it does actually show some stuff. Um, it has, it's a two terabyte and it has uh, two terabytes of free space. Um, but I have to contact the customer to see what they want to do. The laptop over here. A lot of stuff happened off, off camera. We got a new hard drive. We did a clone. And we put it back into the system. And we did the uh, test. And now it's uh, passed. Um, let's check what the um, operating system does. Okay, and so the operating system um, is uh, hanging at this uh, stage right here winload.efi and uh, so we need to reinstall the um, operating system on upgrade mode. Right, so for whatever reason we couldn't do any startup repairs so we're doing a Windows installation and hopefully copy over the files. Alright so Windows installed successfully here so now we're copying the user's data back to um, their uh, account and um, Everything seems to be all right. Let's update it and uh, call up the user. All right, well, here it is. It's all done. We're installing the free Avast here. You need an antivirus on your computers. We're going to do the Windows updates, but I call this...